everybody! Welcome back to Teen Book Tuesday. Uh, my name's Joanna, and I have a cool book to talk to you about. But before the book, first things first, Saturday is one of the biggest and most exciting events of the year, I think. And that is the Cape May County Library's annual Cape Con, which is our very own Comic Con and full of nerdy goodness. So it's going to be held on Saturday at our CIL City Library branch, and it's going to be from 11 o'clock in the morning until 4 o'clock. It is free, it is open to all ages, and we're going to do a lot of really cool stuff. For example, Michelle Knotts is going to be there, and she is a Pokemon voiceover actress. Um, we're also going to be doing a cosplay contest. Disney, Star Wars, and Marvel trivia. Um, we're going to do a Super Smash Brothers tournament. And also all kinds of stuff like face painting and a photo booth and um, anyway, it's just going to be really great and you should all come. And you don't have to wear a costume if you don't want to, but it will be more fun if you do. So stop by and say hi. I will be running the trivia contest um, and uh, we'll be also doing some cardboard cosplay. So if you need a costume, we'll make one. Enough about that. This week's book is Beauty Queens by Libba Bray. So it was in the news last week that um, some filmmakers wanted to make a new adaptation of The Lord of the Flies. So Lord of the Flies, if you haven't read it, is this kind of classic novel in which a group of English schoolboys is shipwrecked on an island. And the novel's all about kind of the disaster that ensues when they try to form their own government. And spoiler alert, they end up trying to torture and kill each other. And so this new film adaptation is supposed to be the same scenario, but with a group entirely of girls. And everyone on Twitter was pretty much like, could you not, please? So I'll let you look into that more if you would like. However, this book, Beauty Queens, is that scenario, but done really well. So the premise of the book is that it's a group of young women who are stranded on an island following a plane crash. And so each of the girls on the plane is um, a contestant in the Miss Teen Dream beauty pageant. And this pageant is run by the corporation, which is a big mega business that sells everything from hair conditioner to firearms. So the plane crashes on the island and the girls have to go from being um, these kind of stereotypical pageant girls to surviving. And behind all that, there's a plot from the corporation to use that plane crash as an excuse to start a war. So you can kind of read it just as like an airplane crash survival story if you would like. But it is way more fun if you read it as satire, which is um, using humor to point out flaws in society. And in this case, the author is pointing out how society treats young women and expects them to look and behave. You guys, it is hilarious. And it's also a really good book to do as an audiobook because um, the author does the narration, she does all the different voices, and there's also sound effects. So we do have the audiobook through Overdrive and Libby, so you can download them to your phone if you'd like. But we also have the playaway version if you don't want to clog up your phone. And we also have the physical copy, too. The Beauty Kings is really great. You should check it out. Um, next week, I'll be reading York by Laura Ruby, and I'll talk to you then.